All right, so hey YouTube, how is everyone doing today? Um, I hope everyone is having a good day, um, having a good week so far. Today is Monday. Today is Monday, January 29th, 2018. But today I am talking about a really important topic. And this topic is, maybe some of you guys can relate more than others, but if you can't, that's okay. I just want you to listen. So, my topic for today is growing up without a father. So, let me, before I start the video, this does not, this, I'm not putting a finger at anyone that I mentioned in the video. I'm just saying, this is what I feel that I need to talk about today. There's no harsh feelings, there's no, just, it's what I want to say. You know what I mean? But, when I say growing up without a father, I don't mean... He's dead. You know what I mean? But he just, my father was never, my father was never there for me when I needed him. So, um, when you, so when you deal, when you're dealing with this situation and, um, when you're dealing with the situation and you going through this problem, it's hard and other people can't like, deal with it as good as I am because I'm a very young, strong young lady. So I think that the impact that me not having my father affected so many areas in my life. So um, it affected so many areas of my life and it's just, it's hard. Like it's hard, but you just have to stay strong. You have to keep going. And just remember who your real father is. Well, I'm a very strong believer in God. I love God. That is my father. He has been there for me since I was born. He's just so good. And he kept me throughout this situation and this process. But I still love my father. I still respect him to this day. And when I do make it, I will, I will look out for him. Like, I really will look out for him, even all the things that he have done, all the things that he have said, but he never did. It's okay because I forgive him. I I accept him for what he has done to me. He didn't do nothing, but he just, when I really needed him, he brought it there. So, if there anyone that's going through the situation, I just would like to tell you, it's going to be okay. Whatever the situation is. It, might, it, could be your, it could be your mother. It could be your father. It could be your aunt. It could be your uncle. That just was supposed to be there for you but have it my word for you is just to keep going trust god no god is gonna work the situation out whatever however so up and i think that you just gotta keep going so let's see what else i can say about this situation so when you don't have a father it impacts what i was saying it impacts so many areas of your life you just you grow up with this mind frame of not having a, a man that's supposed to be there for you but was it there so i feel like with me going through this oh, oh with me going through this i think there's still hope i forgive him but i needed him i'm 14 years old now but i can't change the past but you can live the future. But I think I forgive him. Um, and if you're going through this, it's okay. You can dare me, whatever you want to do. Talk to me about it. Because I've been there. I've been through so much in my life. Just deep. It's deep. But I'll get more into that. But I do want to thank my mom. I want to take this time out to give a special thanks to my mom. My mom has been the MVP. I know y'all saying, well, my mom is the MVP. No, my mom is the MVP. She means the world to me. And I appreciate her for taking on the mother and the father responsibility. She has been there for me for thick and thin. Trials, tribulations, just all types of stuff. But she has stuck by me, and I thank her for that. And I just appreciate her, and I love her so much. So, my, if you watch this, you the MVP. But there's hope, everyone. You can get through it. I've been there. I still respect my... So, and then if you do have a father, still respect him. 
Still show him that you love him, even though all the misunderstandings. That goes for mom, too. Through the misunderstandings, through the, 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 the trials and tribulations, respect them, the, the parent. This is, it's, as a young lady, it's hard not having a father. The man that she's supposed to need to look up to to treat you how a young man supposed to treat you. So by me having to learn that on my own, yes, it's hard. Yes, it's what I'm going to do, what I'm going to do, what I'm going to do. But you can get through it. I'm, I'm dealing with it now. And sometimes you just got to face the fact of what God has just. Well, let me say this. God does stuff for a reason. Everything works together how it's supposed to work together. You cannot have all the things that you want in life because life just don't work like that. So about me wanting my dad, just wanting him to be around me, you know, just you can't have have everything you want. I know, and it's sad that you can't even have your own father, but you can't have everything in life. Life just don't work like that. But I made it. I'm still here. I'm still strong. I still love my dad. Even though he, you know, had his issues, I still love him. I still respect him. And when I make it, I will still look out for him and my mom. The same way. Because you still have to treat people the way you want to be treated. And you have to respect. It's saying the Bible, honor your mother and your father. That means through the thick and thin, through the dirt, through the... You still have to respect them and honor them. Because that's still your partner at the end of the day. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Ask me questions. Not too deep. But ask me questions. Um, Just tell me more stuff that y'all want to know about me. And I love you guys so much. I really do love you guys. Like a lot. And I just hope you guys enjoy your day and like, subscribe and share and comment and tell everyone about me that I'm a very positive person. And if you are new watching my channel, hi, how are you doing? My name is Bri Asia and I'm 14 years old. And just tell people about me, what you want to know and everything. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Be blessed, don't be stressed, and don't create a mess. Love you guys.